today, full name is Gabrielle Hill, but you can call me Gabby. <laughs> I'm going to be completely honest, I did not know what I wanted to do for, uh, like I didn't declare a major, I didn't do anything. I was a little bit interested in nursing, but I mean I was 18 years old. The West Virginia Tech, at the time that campus was in Montgomery. I was a great student, I had like a 3.3 GPA, I'm a really good student, but uh, I had my son the second year of college, so my dreams at that time got deferred a little bit, but that was okay. Once I had my son, I was honestly trying to have a decent job, stable income, so I, <laughs> my mom said I was mall hopping. One of my cousins, she's actually employed with General, CMC General. And she's like, well, why don't you just try to get something here at the hospital? So I applied for like nurse assistant positions. Didn't get any of them. <laughs> they said I didn't have enough experience to be a nurse assistant. But instead, um, I became a member of the housekeeping department at CMC Memorial. Next step, it was actually a friend of mine. We were both in uh, housekeeping, and she was like, "Well, I'm going to a junior college to become a medical assistant, and you should do it too." I've already talked to Kelly, and she's going to see you on the sixth. Has like this bubbly personality, so like I immediately liked her. So I walked in the door, and uh, I remember her asking me questions, you know, about my home life and my children and everything. She. Uh, She's the one that really swayed me into becoming a medical assistant, so. At this time, I now had two small children, so like trying to balance school with children, and then with work, so I was still working. I was working at Payless at the time, and at uh, Memorial as a housekeeper. It was definitely a time, but I had awesome friends, and a few of which I actually graduated nursing with, so. It was, a, it was a great experience. Everyone was always so helpful. Um, if I needed to come in and use a computer, because at the time um, I didn't have like a laptop or anything, so if I needed to come in and use a computer, if I needed to come in and ask questions. So when I first started, I actually lived in Montgomery, so I bust 3 a.m. in the morning with my two small children to take, you know, I get up at three, get on the bus by five, uh, come down here, put them in daycare, walk from there, <laughs> back up. And then uh, when I started you know, the nursing program, I lived on the East End, so I would walk from my home to okay. I always wanted to be a nurse, but you know, like trying to figure out how to balance that and now I have three kids <laughs> and everything, it was just always in the back of my mind, that's what I wanted to do. What really kind of like pushed me in that direction, um, I actually worked with one of the nursing instructors. He said, you should go ahead and apply. And I was like, okay. <laughs> For one, like this campus is beautiful. I love it, classroom sizes, everything. Like there's so much more room. And uh, honestly, going through nursing school with your friends is so much better. I grabbed a group of, a group of girls and we just did the whole thing together. Next thing, hmm, I'm gonna have a BSN RN behind my name, hopefully. <laughs> Where are you doing that? Well, with West Virginia Junior College, of course. 